playing against this Hawks team, or do you have to be a little bit, have to add a little bit more? Well, I mean, first of all, it's about winning. Yeah. You know, and, um, <laughs> and um, you know, this team is um, yeah, it's different than the teams in the past. You know, this is not an isolation team uh, where you can just load up. You know, they move the ball around. They got some very good sets, and um, you know, they play to their players' strengths. So, um, you know, you got to just keep grinding, and keep grinding with the team until you have the ability to put it. Obviously, the story going on with the Hawks and Josh Smith has been going on for some time, but it comes down yeah. to the wire with tomorrow. What's that like? Doing that? I mean, everybody talks about the business aspect, but there's a humanity aspect to it. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't know. Uh, in my in ten years so far, I haven't Got a I really experienced that. But no. like I said, I mean, Josh has been doing this for many years. Yeah. Uh, and Got a chance. And also, anything he's in there, his, swim uh, He's doing what he's supposed to do, and that's just continue to play well. You know, so. Uh, you know, obviously, it's, it's tough for guys to deal with. I've seen teammates go through it. I've seen what it can do for the guys. But um, at the end of the day, you just got to try to continue to just do you and be who you are and know that you can't control it. And, um, you know, what's meant to happen will, will happen. As a guy, you, had, you had a couple of years there where you had the Shaq train almost at the deadline the year after when you, Sean was training for Jermaine. How nice is it that you guys have been able to have continuity the last two, three years to, so that there's no major overhaul in February? Yeah, it's been very, very good. It's good that you know, right now we're not in a lot of trade talk because you know, you know at the end of the day, you know, think about that. Mm -hmm. you know, it messes up the locker room. 